Alright, what is up everybody and welcome to episode 1 of Skyrim Mods. So I'm going to basically be showing you 3 of my favorite mods, or the mods I use right now in everyday use. You know, I just keep them on my Skyrim at all times. So the first mod is a quality world map, so I would not be surprised if many of you have seen this before. But more or less, it, it makes the world map much prettier. I have the version with roads and stuff. This world map is being developed by Ice Penguin, and he's doing a very good job of it. As you can see here, you have roads. Everything just looks a lot prettier and nicer and cleaner, in my opinion. Even though, you know, it's still kind of cluttered, still looks pretty clean. So, awesome clouds. I like the roads, if, especially if you're traveling. Like, let's say you're going to a place you've never been to, and you want to find the fastest route without just wandering around. You could try and stick to the roads, know to where to make turns, and, you know, get there efficiently. So, the second mod I'm going to be showing you, I'm sure many of you have also seen, it is none other than Sky UI. So, the creators of Sky UI more or less thought that the Skyrim UI was designed for console, not PC. So what they did is they add a search function. So let's see, what can we search? Um, iron ingot, or however you say that word. But uh, yeah, so you got a search function, you have much easier to access organized tabs like this. And then I thought you could uh, still see all the things on the sides, but you don't have to select them all. You could just scroll through them and stuff. A lot nicer, you could organize things through armor, weight, value, name that was was that the, i don't think that was there before but uh yeah and then you have all these different tabs it also works with magic so let's see magic and you could see you could do by school skill level spell cost again search and you have all of these nicely organized and you also have your favorites which actually on the top of topic of favorites let's get into our final mod which is the cat oh, oh wrong menu categorized favorites menu so, I like this mod a lot because, you know, I don't favor that many things, but I favor enough for it to become useful. And the other favorites menu is just a very cluttered list. Even if you had this many things favorited, you would, uh, you know, it would be way too long and hard to read. This keeps everything organized. It gives you a nice little menu here. You could have all these cool options also. Unequipped all, just fists, unequipped left, unequipped right. And also these, when you hit unequipped all, it does not unequip your armor which I find very useful. Oh wait, I just totally neglect myself. I don't know. It, oh, I, I see. It only unequips the things you have in the favorites menu, which is nice. So if you don't have it, if you don't have it in this menu, you know you could easily like it won't unequip it. So all the things it unequips, you could easily put back on, which is awesome in my opinion. You so let's see, I got Orcus Sword and all this, so, and that was so easy to get. With the old menu, it would have been very difficult to get that all. And also some of these things in here, like you're, if I already know, I'm gonna get comments. Why do you have a gold necklace and stuff? That's just to have something in there. But uh, yeah, so that is today's episode. That are all three mods I was going to show you by today or for today um i'm sure i made some mistakes in here i'm not surprised my first episode might not be the best quality but uh i hope to improve over time but uh overall what this series is is my little disclaimer part of course but i'm gonna more or less in the series show three mods off it'll be one mod which is utility this is my goal for it at least this episode i did not do that at all i just used the three mods i normally use because you know it was easier on me but what i would prefer to do is do one mod that's like utility so if you know what utility means it's like kind of like you know like all the three mods i showed today would be utility you know it changes the ui it changes a map you know it doesn't really add anything to the game it changes some features but it doesn't add any items or anything but the second category would be you know adding items adds a player home adds some weapons adds a new dragon to fight stuff like that and then the third mod which i want to do three mods every every episode the third mod would be just a cool mod I saw, you know, one mod that I thought, wow, this is cool, I want to put it in my episode. It'll be something like that. Um, some weeks I may only have two, because I never found a cool mod, you know, who knows, we'll see how things play out. Guard might get nervous, a man approaches with a weapon, with his weapon drawn. Well, this is awkward. Um, do, do you see anybody over here? So, uh, let's see how we end this video. Die, Mr. Guard. 
Oh yeah, you are very good at defense. Well, good thing I don't use one-handed weapons, so now let's actually use this in uh, action. Hello, Mr. Guard. Oh, I just punched him. That was not... I punched him again. Alright, I'm gonna set you on fire, Mr. Guard. And also, I'm a very low level. I haven't had much time to play Skyrim at all, but oh god, we got a uh, guard city up here. So, uh, on that note, I'm going to run away, leave Berlin to die, and uh, see you all next time.